Well, hi, this is Custom Works. I'm Clint Allen, and if you want to know what your IDM looks like, the location of it, and how simple it is to get it out without having to remove the quarter panel, somebody recently emailed me, uh, asked a few questions, and then kind of got upset because they had to remove their quarter panel in order to get at the IDM. No, please don't. Uh, Basically, this, this fender right here just comes out easy as pie. And we're on the driver's side. Yeah, I know, I got the quarter panel off, but we're partner down. But either which way, this is a number 10. So number number 10 bolt right there that goes into the IDM. And then these are number eights. Simple as that to get your IDM out of there. That's the bracket that holds it on. Give you a close up again. Close up. Close up. And once again, you don't have to take your quarter panel off. You just, there's there. two rubber connectors right here. That comes down. There's a small retaining bolt here, small retaining bolt here, small retaining bolt right here. Fold it back, turn your tire inward, fold this back, and you'll be able to get at your IDM no problem from underneath the quarter panel. Piece of cake, don't have to remove the whole panel, don't have to rip apart the whole truck. Simple as that. So once again, hope you learned something. You take it easy and y'all have a good day.